So breaking news. We now have a much clearer picture on where the search and rescue teams and recovery efforts will be conducted now uh, for the remains of James Hutchinson. After court today, it has been released that the recovery teams have now ha received a much clearer picture of where Brittany Gosney, mother, age 29, and her fiancé, James Hamilton, age 42, actually disposed of James's body. It is miles from where they, the search and re recovery efforts had been held up to this point, and now they know exactly where to start looking to recover James Hutchinson's body. Why don't you go ahead and click that subscribe button right now. And don't forget to hit the bell icon so you'll be notified when I upload new content here on 411 Now. So here on the screen, you will now see a map. This is the Carroll Cropper Bridge, which crosses the river there on I-275. They pulled up on the actual bridge and tossed James over the railing with a concrete block on his chest and attached to him with rope. Now, this is uh, about a mile and a half upriver from where they said that they'd actually disposed of James's body. Well, now we know that they actually tossed him over the railing of the Carroll Cropper Bridge, which is on I-275. They weren't anywhere near the Rush Run Park when they actually threw him into the water. Additionally, we now know when Brittany Gosney, the mother, and James Hamilton will now stand trial for what they did to not only James Hutchinson, but we will also know when they will find, you know, finally have to stand up and be heard on the charges of what they did to uh, James Hutchinson. Brittany Gosney is due to go on trial at this point right now on September 20th. James Hamilton court date has been set for October 4th. Now, these dates are flexible because the court system right now, even after setting these dates, stated that because of the COVID backlog of cases that are happening before them, these dates may actually be pushed out to a further date. Brittany Gosney is charged with first-degree murder, manslaughter, tampering with evidence, child endangerment, kidnapping, and an abuse of a corpse. 15 total felony charges. At the very minimum, if she was to get the minimum on all 15 of the felony charges that she is looking at right now, she will get approximately 61 years. James Hamilton, age 42, if his uh, charges are 15 felonies as well, kidnapping, gross abuse of a corpse, child endangerment, tampering with evidence, and child abduction. At the bare minimum on his charges, he is looking at 24 years. There are no murder charges that are filed against James Hamilton at this time. But now, now we finally know where search and discovery will actually locate, you know, and be able to search for. Are you looking for factually documented true crime coverage of cases from around the world? Well, if you are, then you have found the right channel. Here on 411 Now, all I cover on this channel is factually documented cases, information that you can get nowhere else or is in mainstream media with the hype and the, the speculation and the rumors cut out of it all. And here on 411 Now, I put up new content four days a week and I live stream two days a week. So six days a week, you get brand new, fresh content. So why don't you go ahead and click that subscribe button right now. And don't forget to hit the bell icon so you'll be notified when I upload new content here on 411 Now.